The boys are leaving me to yes. go to the front of house, yes. where they both work as waiters today. No, we're going to sell. You're going to what? I'm going to sell. Sell? Myself. Oh, yes. how much do you get? A lot of money. <laughs> So, how do you do, into of us? And welcome to Stories of My Life. So today, Friday, we're having a show. I'm going into the theatre and I'm meeting this man who I have is checked out on Marketplace, Facebook Marketplace, who has a pair of boots that I, I really want. So I'm meeting him today at three o'clock outside. Well, I'll show you later. But now I'm going on my cross-training for half an hour of cross-training and watching Magnus on the go going on. I hope you like the new um, thing for March the 1st. What do you call it? Well, that little snippet where there's a man running by. So I'm done drinking water now. Watching, I've been watching Magnus on the go. He's in some place where there's in my um, pyramid. I can't remember the name of it. Sort of, even though I watch every day, you sort of get, what, what, yeah, he's, he's at this place now. Yeah, he's doing that now. Um, he seems a bit lonely, I think, because he talks a lot, or he sort of uses, which I also do, uses the phone as a sort of means to sort of clear your head or, or um, rationalise what you're doing. Or should I do that? Should I do that? Should I, should I, should that happen? So today I was visiting this place where one of the wonders of the world, I don't know, somewhere in Mexico, and he, they didn't have guided tours. You have to sort of lease your own guide or rent your own guide. And he was all alone. So he thought, no, that's too much money. And then he sort of went all around this area with questions. And he said, well, maybe I should have, you know, rented that guide or do, done something about it. But now I have to go home and look up everything I did not quite understand because he was quite quite mad at all the information because this is no good, this is no good, this information I don't understand, I have questions. And if, had there been a guide, this, I think the, the thing would have been if the museum or whatever it was had, you know, guided tours. That would have been the best. So people wouldn't have to sort of look up guides themselves and sort of, can you guide us? I never heard of that. Anyway, time for my vegan lunch. Then I'm getting on my bike and going into uh, the works. Uh, today, Helen is out, one of the female leads, but she's uh, that, that's a planned. She, she's not ill or anything like that. And Jenny is covering her. She's, she's done it before. She's fantastic. She's really fantastic. Helen is, of course, uber fantastic. So um, not to trample on anyone's toes, but... It's going to be a real treat today. Okay, people, time to get going. When the going go good. Look who showed up. He just left his bag and left. What is he, what is he about to do? He also took out his shoes. Something is wrong with the bag, he said. Is this even leather? So, I got a new pair of sunglasses, by the way. Yes! Looking good! About to go and get a pair of boots. Lucas, on the other hand, is... He's about to go to the shoe repair man and get his bag fixed. Or at least talk to him. <laughs> I'm really excited about these shoes. Because they were so, they're two sizes too big for me, but they were so inexpensive that I have to get them. So I'm, I'm not going to count my eggs before they hatch. I think it's the same. So I'm not going to count my boots before I have them on my feet. It's another saying that I just invented. So I'm going to meet the person outside H&M store. Fabulous. In about five minutes. Here I am five minutes early because that's who I am. I keep looking at stuff here. I might go in and buy something later on. 
So these shoes are really unusual because I looked on them online and I can't find them. So I'm really interested and I sort of build up this sort of who is this guy? And I think in my he might be working for H&M because that's the way he got these really unusual shoes. Because they are H&M Moschino collaboration. But they, I haven't seen them for sale anywhere. He texted me that he will be in a pink top and a pink hat. That sounds interesting. This sounds like an interesting person. It could be that guy over there. Yes, that was him. Over there, the pink hat. And here are the shoes. Fabulous. He was really, really nice. And he said that the reason he sold them was that he, he wasn't wearing them enough. And he bought them a couple of years ago. And only for, I mean, I paid $20 for them. They're in rhinestone. Madness. Monk cut his hair. Huh? And my brows and uh, my facial hair. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, this is going to be your face. When you see my pair of new boots, they cost me, they're second hand. They cost me 200 Swedish crowns, which is nothing. And here they are. Snap. Slay. Yeah. Slay. Isn't it mad? They're good. They're yes. Good. People look at this. They're good. They're really, really good. And I mean... Twenty dollars is nothing. Is it real leather? Yeah, it's yeah, it's sort of a collaboration. Moschino H and M. Oh, I think it's Moschino H and M. Yes, H M Moschino. So I don't need anything else today. People, here they go. I mean, everyone loves them. I'm going to show this to David. He is about to die. David? Yeah. You're about to die. Okay. I don't mind. Ooh. Glamour. Guess how much I paid for them. 2,300 crowns. 200 crowns. Ooh. Uh, Anna Lawson. The boys are leaving me to yes. go to the front of house, yes. where they both work as waiters today? No, we're going to sell. You're going to what? I'm going to sell. Sell? Myself. Oh, yes. how much do you get? A lot of money. <laughs> I call these my Elton John sunglasses, for obvious reasons. This is Simon. He's gonna, I'm going to teach him now how to use a washing machine because he doesn't know. I'll show this to my mother. He lives with his mother and she does all the washing, apparently. So, you put things in the machine. This thing. Yes. The things you need washing. So, yes. So, then you close the door. Then you open. What, what do you think you'll do next? I think I will open this. Yes. Oh, yeah. Then you put it on. You put some of that in. Uh, and hole scooper. Yes, and hole scooper. In here then? Yes. Should I? Yes. Yes. You do not know. Yeah, now he's got it. Yes. Yes, try that. Good. Here they go. Yes. Well, you need to... Stop. Yes. Yes. Wow. Did it start? No. I think so. No, I don't think so. Maybe you should press it a little bit longer. It's blinking. Yeah. No. Now it no, started. Blinking. Yes. Uh, you did very well. Thank you so much. Question? Second question. Yeah? The torque tumbler. Yeah? After I use it, I put it in. Yes. When this is done. Yeah. And I don't even take a program. Yeah, but you can't do that now because I'm going to be using them tonight. So the easiest way would just be to hang them. Hang them here. But and, uh, this I know. Yes. Or, uh, yes. Okay. So don't put them there because I'll be I'll be using them later on I will, tonight. I will be because 
that is three hours. Oh shit. This is three hours, 35 minutes. Yeah. I will put it on the clock. So are you still here then? Yeah, we'll be here. Yeah, come on, we'll be here. So, for the last couple of weeks, one of the act horses, Sophia, has not been flying at the end of the opening number. She sort of stands, well, I'm not going to tell you what happens. I'm not going to tell you anything. It's a secret. It's not a secret. Not anymore. Anyway, so today she's going to fly again because the thing that they were changing has been fixed. So now she can. So I have to be here instead of being backstage. I'm, you know, just stages. On the other side of this wall, I'm going to show you. Yeah, that's the stage. So if I suddenly scream, they would hear me on stage, not the audience. Well, I just need to show you the coolest person, not only the room, in this whole effing theatre right now. Who? Me? You're damn right. So today, Lisa is the boss. Yes. half past 11 and it's time to get going. I've been here for about an hour doing the laundry so that I don't have to come in so early in the morning. In the morning. But now, time to get to the home. Thank you for watching and for Liking, commenting, subscribing and following, it really helps and uh, something to do with the internet and the algorithm, I think. So thank you so much.